Okay, day 35 of doing one mile a day every day uh, for 35 days in a row. So I'll put the uh, camera on and we'll get going. Pretty nice out today, warm. Start the timer. Put in your guesses of how far I'll go. I'm gonna do at least 1.15 miles today. And uh, guess how long I'll go and how long it'll take me. Helicopter overhead. I'm gonna walk down this way. Kind of in the same neighborhood as yesterday, but I'm gonna do, uh, different route. There's a train up there. Looks like it's floating on the air. Let's see where we can go today. Alright. Guess how many dogs we'll see. Saw two dogs walking a minute ago. Put the over and under at about three and a half. Oh, there's a couple of cats up here. See, so yeah, I guess I'll walk. Uh, I don't know which way I'm going. Kind of confused today. We'll go this way and come back. See what we see. Oh, we see something interesting. I kind of wanted to get those, let those people go by me before I started going, but I kind of wanted to go down there and then come back. Get behind them. See what we see today. Got a big dog. A little dog. Walk a little bit of block this way and turn around and go back the other way. We got their St. Patrick's Day uh, decorations up. Meow. The little kitty. Meow. He's coming running out to me. Or he's running away. One of the two. Meow. Kitty, kitty. Oh, two cats. Meow. Oh, this one's coming right it over. Hey, buddy. Meow. How you doing, buddy? Well, he's going to turn over. You want to be petted, huh? <laughs> he's a friendly guy. Pretty white. Hi, buddy. Meow. Friendly, hey buddy. Yeah. <laughs> The other cat trotting along. Meow. He's coming back. <laughs> the friendly kitty. Okay, buddy. Have a good day, get some sun. It's supposed to rain tomorrow. Get out today and enjoy it. Two cats, two dogs already. Yeah, it's supposed to rain tomorrow, so get out and do a mile or so today. And do at least 1.15 today.
there's a VW Bug that's later model. Looks like they got little flowers on there. Decorated it. I don't know what that car's doing. Turning around, doing circles. Not that we're coming down here or what. Going back the other way. That's a later year. VW, I don't know what year that is. Sure it's a girls. See what we see down here. The lemon tree. Lemons all over it. Falling off of it. They got a red swing. Out front. Walk on this side of the street. Walk down here. See, where am I at? Where did I park? Ramona and Ramona and Fisk. Get so turned around here, I won't know where I'm going. Oh, that's car. I walked past here yesterday. Trying to go a different route. Hmm. Well, yeah. Shoot. Walked down this street yesterday. Goodness. We'll walk straight up this street. I know I didn't walk straight up this street yesterday. We'll see what we see up this street. Yeah, we'll get going here in a minute. You go into a new area, you don't know where you've been and where you haven't been. A couple streets up here though that I know I haven't been down. from foreign Germany what is it I don't even know what it is there's a couple big old dog over there tails wagging <coughs> barking and come over and say hello <laughs> he's coming over to say hello Hey buddy, how you doing? <laughs> Just wanted some pets, huh? Yeah. It's a good boy, huh? It's a good boy. Are you gonna lay down? It's a big dog, huh? What are you doing today, buddy? It's a good boy, huh? That's a good guy. You like the sun today? Oh, that's a good girl, huh? You like that, huh? Tummy rub. <laughs> that's your spot, huh? All right, come on. Let's go back. <laughs> He's friendly. Yeah. <laughs> Lizard, see it? A little lizard. I don't know if you can see it on the camera. He's on top of that brick. A little lizard. Got a blue door. They're doing some work on their house. <laughs> Funny that. Part lab, I guess, just comes running over. It's friendly. I didn't even call for her, really. Just saw me walk into the house. It comes running over like the uh, like the cat. The cat comes running over. 
usually cats don't come running up to strangers like that. Labs will sometimes though. Cut across over this side of the street. See what's going on over here. A greenhouse. No pun intended. You know, write down how many days in a row this is for you. This is, uh, what did I say, 30, 35 days in a row. See if I can do, made it to 30 days. See if I can get up to 60. 60 in a row. It's supposed to rain tomorrow, though. What's this? This is a, uh, it's like another Impala. It is an Impala. Chevrolet, early 70s. I, oh, 66. It says right there. 66 Impala. Yeah, I should have known that. The taillights are much different. It's like it's a body's in good shape. It's like it's been painted. I don't think that was factory color. Looks good. I tore down a school or something right here. And I guess they're going to build back another one. Been torn down for a while now. Come the clouds. You can see the clouds look ominous here. Not supposed to rain till tonight. It's supposed to rain start tonight. Rain Monday and Tuesday. We got a red door. Hearts for Valentine's Day. It's over now though. Let's start bringing out the St. Patrick's Day stuff, but I guess by the time I have this video posted, St. Patrick's Day will be over too. Walk down the other side of this street. See what we see over there. He's got a big old RV up here. Look at that thing. Not going across the street though. Taking up the whole driveway. Oh. Goodness. Has to go on some big trips. Big RV. Look at the size of that thing. Man, it looks like it's sleep 20. Wow, like an 18 wheeler. be the first cat that I've petted now on this channel now I've petted a uh, neighbor's cat Popo I've always petted him before the first cat that's uh, I petted on a string that came up to me that I didn't know Just came right up the ranger won't come up to people He'll follow me around and walk around the block with me, but he won't uh, the Harley Davidson motorcycle. It's the first Harley I've seen. But Ranger won't come up to strangers normally. Most cats won't. Let's see what's going on on this street. Always see a. Seems like we always see at least one antique older car on these trips. We saw that Impala. So what was it? Sixty? What did it say? Sixty-six? Something like that? Sixty-eight? Yesterday we saw that. Uh, Ranchero and uh, we saw that newer uh, sky blue Bronco the Impala was kind of sky blue and we saw the sky blue house sky blue was a color of the day
kept calling them aqua, but it was really more sky blue. And yesterday I couldn't think of uh, 10 Downing Street, where the Buckingham Palace is located. Of course, I thought of it just as I turned the camera off. 10 Downing Street, 1600 Pennsylvania Avenue. Where the White House is. As I was talking about seeing that uh, house, it was address was 1. See what we see today. We got a gold post in their yard. Look at that. As they kick the they kick the field goal, it's gonna go over the the neighbor's yard. But they look like look like a yellow gold post just like in a football field, mini gold post. It's a different house on this row. Most of these are these one, one story ranches. A, I don't know what kind of Cape Codish two story. Oh, look at this tree. It's already blooming. February, mid February. Look at this. I don't know what it is. Pretty white. Comment below if you know what it, kind of tree it is. I don't know what it is. Get a little closer. Seems early to bloom already. The house has got a sky blue trim and the sky blue house next to it. A lot of beachy colors at the beach area. This car, the car the house is dark maroon, burnt, burnt maroon. I don't know what color you call that. Here's another sky blue house. Don't walk down this way though. All right, point six seven. I okay, saw so that house yesterday. Let's go down another street I haven't been down before. It'll be at one point one five before you know it. Voting for Holly Mitchell. Walk up this street and see what we see. So all the houses are different colors. That one's yellow, that one's another kind of brick house. Say you don't ever see any brick houses. I don't know if that's real brick or not. Might be half brick and another stucco that's that's brown. A brown stucco. Gray stucco. Green, olive-ish, I guess green stucco. It's a two, got a two-story added uh, to the back, bigger house. Oh, look at this nice yard. That putting green. Even got a rail around it. Maybe they were actually putting. What this is? Some kind of school or something? Church? There's people in there. 
don't know, maybe it's a church. It must be a church. I don't know. I don't know what it is. The little dog says, beware of the dog. Two dogs look just alike. <laughs> they actually have a putting green. Look at that. They got a little putting green up there. Uh, they come out here and putt around every now and then. Bougainvillea and putting green. The first house I've seen with an actual putting green. I've seen grass look like a putting green. But they actually have a putting green. Nice. Oh, look at this yard. Another one. It's real grass or fake grass? It's fake. Looks nice though. I guess they come out and vacuum it. They don't mow it, obviously. Vacuum it. A lot of houses in this neighborhood with that type of fake putting green grass. But it sure looks nice. Don't ever have to mow it. Again, more of it. Fake grass. But it looks nice. And you don't have to water it either. I don't know how much that costs. Probably three, three, four thousand dollars. I assume. I don't really know. They got two Mustangs. Oh, that's a bullet. Never seen one of those. I mean, late model. Mustang bullet. I think it's, uh, we got two, oh, they're both bullets. Wow. The name after that movie that uh, Paul Newman was in. Or not Paul Newman. Uh, Steve McQueen. Bullet. I know the movie and I know the car, but I have never seen that movie. So comment down below if you've seen uh, Steve McQueen in Bullet. Apparently that was a super famous uh, chase scene. And uh, he did it. He drove. He did his own chase scene in that, from what I understand. But I'd never seen it. Apparently, he was a, obviously an expert, ex uh, expert driver. Another sky blue house here on the corner. But the name of the movie was Bullet. And it was a. Is it a I guess it was a Mustang. I don't really know, to be honest. I think it was a Mustang. And let me know if you've seen that movie. It's what, I think it was 68, 72. I don't know what year it was, but I know that chase scene is super famous, but I've, I've only seen big bits and pieces of it. I don't even know the storyline of that movie. I should watch it. I know that's like one of the most famous chase scenes in uh, movie history. Matter of fact, I don't know if I've ever seen a movie with Steve McQueen in it. I know in his day he was a uh, matinee idol with uh, Robert Redford and Paul Newman and Steve McQueen. And the tough guys back then. I don't know who the tough guys are anymore. Who would be a tough guy now? Whew. Back in the day, John Wayne. Who would it be now? Huh. Tom Cruise? He's not really a tough guy. Really. Mark Wahlberg? I don't know. Um, that movie they paid about four of the expendables one of those guys I guess they're all kind of Stallone and Schwarzenegger they're from 
really 30, 40 years ago from their heyday as well. Who is the tough guy? Jason, uh, what's his name? Stedham? Can't think of his last name. But he's, I don't think he's anywhere in the categories. Newman and McQueen. And I don't know if Robert Redford was considered a tough guy. Charles Bronson. Oh, Clint Eastwood. Seems like all those guys are no more. Nobody came up to replace him. It? No, well, he's more of a pretty boy type. He'd be considered a tough guy. Oh, where have all the tough guys gone? Got a movie called The Magnificent Seven. See what we see down here. We got a whole flagpole here. Flagpole. As they say if you fly up, burglars say if they see a house with a flag, they're gonna pass on by because they know that house has guns in it. And I think that's probably true. It's a week ago we saw a house with a flag and a U Marine Corps flag. I bet they had multiple guns. I don't think the burglars are going to go for that house. They'll just go on down the block. Last thing they want to do is try to rob a house that's got guns in it. Another yard with the putting green grass. Might have walked down this street yesterday. They got a uh, bouncy house having a kids party over there. Two of them. Two bouncy houses. Looks like they're playing pickleball. Game of the year, pickleball. Oh, bird right in front of me. Another Bronco. We saw saw that uh, sky blue Bronco yesterday. Here's another one. It's not sky blue, but they started making them three or four years ago. What is it? Color is it kind of like that? Dark gray. Dark dark gray. Outer Banks. Well, that's about it. Head back to the car. Two more flags over there. A lot of patriotic people in this neighborhood. Guess that's it. Another interesting walk. Let's see, where did I park? I think I'm one more street down. That's where I parked yesterday, I think. I'm not sure. Yeah, I think I'm one more street down. So I'll walk down here then. There's a late model Camaro. I used to have a 81 Camaro. That's really a. I don't know, maybe. Last three or four years? I don't know what year that is. Let me know if you know.
where I parked. I don't think I, maybe I'm one more street down. Not sure. I think you go to these new places and don't really remember. Where I parked. I think it's right up here. Yeah, that's where I petted the cat. There he is. Meow. That's another cat. He didn't come over. I don't think he will. It's the other one that was friendly. your buddy huh you just got to me first like being petty you gonna roll over too yeah got a tail up nice and friendly huh you gonna roll over <laughs> maybe you guys are friends huh Uh-oh, gotta be careful about petting a cat on his stomach. They entice you to do it, then they bite you. Not like dogs. I'm gonna roll over again. Alright, buddy. I'll see you later. See you later. See you next time. Yeah, I'm parked right down here. Well, what do we see? Three or four? Saw two dogs strike right to start off with. And I petted the black lab, the lab mix. So I guess there's three or four dogs and two friend two really friendly cats. Unusual. Have cats come up to you like that. Alright, that's it. Back to where we started, back to that uh Black Thunderbird I saw yesterday talked about that it was made famous in the movie American Graffiti it was a movie that came out in the 70s but it featured uh, it was all about the 50s and that's where Ron Howard was in that movie and then they saw him in that movie and decided he'd be great for uh, Happy Days so they brought that Thunderbird back started to make him again retro in the like the retro type in the 70s uh about 10 years ago they made them i looked it up they made them for about three or four years and that was it they look good good looking car all right that's it if you like the channel subscribe check out some of the other videos like i said yesterday was saw a lot of cool stuff yesterday too ranchero and uh sky blue bronco and i put a link to some of the other videos and uh that's it we'll see you tomorrow hopefully not in the rain bye